Your vote 2020 tonight. We are hearing from the two candidates in the 36th congressional district race. Republican Aaron Cruz, who is challenging the Democratic incumbent, Dr. Raul Ruiz. News Channel 3's Jake Gracia goes in depth with them tonight on the issues ahead of Election Day, just more than one month away now. There's definitely some challenges campaigning in a pandemic, but there's also opportunities. We've got to see a change in D.C. Aaron Cruz, a Republican from Palm Springs, and Dr. Raul Ruiz, a Democrat from Palm Desert and the incumbent, are the candidates up against each other in the race for the 36th District U.S. House of Representatives seat. On coronavirus relief from the federal government, Cruz says she's fed up with partisan gridlock. Middle ground, where's the middle ground? Where's actually serving the people? Why can't Congress move forward on a simple stimulus that way to, to help people who are struggling without all their backdoor deals, without their maneuvering? Ruiz says the inaction from Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell has been frustrating. You cannot have aid without another stimulus check or enhanced unemployment or protections for people who are about to be, be evicted. On campaign finances, according to the FEC, as of June 30th, Ruiz has raised more than $1.8 million in contributions. The vast majority of the contributions to my campaign are from individuals. Uh, because this is a people powered campaign. Cruz just under $6,500. She says her candidacy is funded by regular everyday people. They want to have true representation that isn't bought. I don't take big pack money. I've been offered pack money. I don't take big pack money. Don't take special interest dollars. Let me ask you though, do you worry that that deficit could hurt you in your election effort? Absolutely not. Let's go rapid fire on some of those big ticket issues, uh, abortion and health care and your stances there. The federal government should not be dictating what a woman can or cannot do with her own body. I am um, pro-life from conception. In terms of health care, I am 100 uh, percent defending Medicare uh, to ensure that people who have pre-existing condition will be protected. I've heard from the individuals out there in the community state that they would like to see Obamacare reformed or um, adjusted. And on environmental issues like the historic wildfires ravaging California and the role of climate change. We're going to have more frequent and more intense fires if we don't do something about climate change. We have to reduce our carbon emission and our reliance on fossil fuels by promoting the renewable energy that my district, that our district can produce. Climate change is here all the time. It's always been here. And I think to be naive about that is, um, it's just naive. Ruiz says the Salton Sea environmental crisis has been a priority for him since he's been in office. I am as impatient as anybody else, not wanting any studies. I want to focus on what's necessary to start and complete projects in order to prevent the dust from harming our children's and our elderly's lungs. The candidate's messages to the voters here in the 36th district. Have you had enough yet? Do you want to see different action taken that benefits your community? If you have had enough, go to AaronCruz.org. We need somebody who's going to put people above partisanships, solutions above ideology. Uh, and I have done that uh, effectively. Jake Gracia, News Channel 3.